whom the ancient predators were afraid. Tyrannosaurus Rex was one of the largest and strongest predators of his time. But even such a powerful creature could have fear or avoid a clash with other animals, although he had practically no real enemies. Here are a few creatures that could cause fears among the Tyrannosaurus. Tyrannosaurs were territorial animals and could enter into conflicts with each other. Finds of fossil bones show traces of bites and serious injuries, which proves brutal contractions between individuals beyond the territory, food, or partners. Triceratops possessed a massive body and long sharp horns. An adult Triceratops could pose a serious threat to a Tyrannosaurus. On the bones of Tyrannosaurs, traces of wounds caused by the horns of these herbivores are often found. Ankylosaurs were covered with powerful bone armor and possessed a massive mace at the end of the tail. The blow of this pin could break bones or seriously injure a Tyrannosaurus. The Tyrannosaurus preferred to avoid a fight with large adult ankylosaurs. In reality, the main fear for the Tyrannosaurus was not a meeting with a specific opponent, but hunger or serious injuries that could lead to the impossibility of hunting and subsequent death. Events such as forest fires, floods, or volcanic activity could also cause panic or fear of Tyrannosaurus, since it was powerless to resist the forces of nature. Although the Tyrannosaurus was the top of the food chain, he was not absolutely invulnerable and could be afraid of individual animals or situations that threatened his life and prosperity. The Spinosaurus was the largest predatory dinosaur, known today, and reached impressive sizes of up to 60 feet in length. Despite this, even he could face worthy opponents. A large predator about 43 feet long with powerful jaws and teeth similar to shark. Carcharodontosaurus lived at the same time with Spinosaur. The struggle between them could be fierce. Sarcosuchus, a giant prehistoric crocodile, reaching a length of up to 40 feet. Sarkozuk lived in rivers and lakes, was an excellent predator in the water, and could successfully compete with the Spinosaurus for prey. The conflict between them could be likely near reservoirs. Rugops, predatory dinosaur of medium sized up to 26 feet in length. Although he was inferior to the Spinosaur in size, the flock of Rugops could pose a serious threat in competition in the struggle for food. Like most large predators, conflicts between representatives of the same species could be frequent. The struggle for the territory, food resources or partners could lead to serious fights between two adult Spinosaurs. Paralytitan A giant Zoroprop, more than 80 feet long and weighing up to 60 tons. Despite the fact that this Isa voyage dinosaur, he possessed huge sizes, and even one blow of his massive tail or leg could become fatal for Spinosaur. Large pterosaurs, for example, as darkids. Despite the fact that there would be no direct battle between them, pterosaurs could compete for prey, for example, fish, especially if the Spinosaur was greatly dependent on the fish diet. Thus, the Spinosaur, although it was one of the largest and most powerful dinosaurs, still faced serious competition and threats from other mighty predators and giant animals of his era. Allosaurus was a large and powerful predator of the late Jurassic period about 155 million years ago. Although the Allosaurus occupied a high stage of the food chain of its time, there were several creatures and factors that could cause fears or to pose a serious danger. The most serious opponents of Allosaur were other representatives of his own species. Competition for the territory, food or partners could lead to fierce contractions. On the remains of Allosaurs, evidence of such battles is often found, bites and injuries inflicted by other individuals. Zoropods, for example, diplods, brachiosaurs. Despite the fact that Allosaurs hunted young and sick zoropods, adults of Diplodocus, Brachiosaurus and other giant herbivores were dangerous prey. 
Massive bodies, powerful legs and heavy tails of these dinosaurs could cause serious injuries or even kill the attacker of Allosaurus. Stegazaver possessed massive spikes on the tail, the so-called Tagonizer, which could effectively defend himself from attack. The tail of the tail of the Stegosaurus could easily injure or kill even such a large predator as Allosaurus. Torvozaver was one of the largest carnivorous dinosaurs, which lived simultaneously with the Alzor. He was more massive and had more powerful jaws. A collision with a Torvosaur, especially for prey, could lead to serious consequences. Although the Ceratosaurus was slightly less than the Allosaurus, it possessed strong jaws and a large horn on the nose, which could cause dangerous injuries. This was especially true for fights for the territory and prey. The real threats for Allosaurus were also hunger and injuries. Any serious injury could deprive him of the ability to hunt, which would inevitably lead to death from hunger or attack of other predators. Allosaurs, like other creatures, could be afraid of natural disasters, such as volcanic eruptions, earthquakes, floods and fires before which they were powerless. Although the Allosaurus was one of the main predators of the Jurassic period, it was not absolutely invulnerable and had many reasons to avoid clashes with certain animals and situations. Velociraptor was relatively small, but an extremely effective predator of the late nerd period, about 70 million years ago. Due to their sizes, and this is 6 feet long and weighed up to 15 kilograms, cycle cyclists were vulnerable to larger predators and had many dangerous competitors. The greatest competition was bicycle cyclists by representatives of their own type. The struggle for food, territory, or partners often led to aggressive clashes. Denonychus A larger relative of the cycling, which also had powerful sickle claws on the hind legs. Denonia was stronger, larger, and could easily displace cycling from their hunting areas. Tarbosaurus a huge predator, about 40 feet long, a close relative of the Tyrannosaurus, who lived in the same regions as the cycling. This is modern Mongolia. Tarbosaurus could kill cycling and take prey from them, pose a deadly threat. Protoceratops. Although it was a herbivore dinosaur, he posed a serious threat to a cycle cyclist. The Protocratops was a massive animal with a strong beak and a powerful body that could cause serious injuries. Fraternal finds are known that demonstrate a deadly battle between these two types. Oviraptors were omnivorous dinosaurs up to 7 feet in size, which could compete with cycle cyclists for eggs, chicks and small prey. Although direct contractions were rare, competition for food resources was inevitable. Sauronthoids. Another small varad, about 10 feet that inhabited Mongolia at the same time. He was dexterous and fast, which made him a competitor to the cycle cyclopter when hunting small animals and reptiles. Truden Smart and clever dinosaur in size up to 7 feet. Trudens hunted flocks and had large eyes, allowing them to successfully hunt at night. They could compete with cycling, displacing them from the richest hunting grounds. Large flying reptiles, with a wave of wings up to 33 feet, could hunt for the same small animals and carrion as the cycling, representing competition for resources. Mosasaurus were large marine reptiles that prevailed in the Latial period about 82 million years ago. They were at the top of the food chain of sea ecosystems of their time. However, even such powerful predators had serious and dangerous competitors. The main competition of the Mosasaurus took place with representatives of their own species or with other Mosasaurids, for example, Tylosaur or Vitriol. The struggle for territory, prey and partners could lead to fierce contractions. Tylosaurus. A huge Mosasaurite reaching up to 50 feet in length. Tylosaurus had powerful jaws and aggressive character, which made it a serious competitor for the Mozars. Both species could enter into contractions for prey and territory. Pliosaurs. Gig Monty sea reptiles with massive jaws, living about about the start of the spread of the Mosa makers. 
Although chronologically, pliosaurs more often lived a little earlier than the Mozars, some of their species could partially coexist, competing for resources. Cretoxorina mantelli, the so-called shark prize, was a large predator, up to 26 feet long, inhabiting the sea of Lake Chalk. These sharks could compete with the Mozars for food and even attack young or sick Mozorians. Ziphactinus, a huge predatory fish, reaching up to 20 feet long. Ziphactin possessed powerful jaws and sharp teeth and could compete with young or medium-sized Mozaras for food. Elasmosaurs were long-length marine reptiles, capable of reaching 46 feet long. They occupied similar ecological niches, competing for fish and cephalopods. In some cases, the Mosa Uglers could attack them, but adult individuals of elasmosaurs could successfully fight off and even injure the attackers. Megalodon or Otodus Megalodon was the largest predatory shark in the history of the Earth, which lived about 23 million years ago. Reaching a size of 60 feet in length, Megalodon dominated the sea ecosystems and occupied the top of the food chain. Despite this, Megalodon had competitors and potentially dangerous opponents. The most serious clashes could occur between Megalodons for food resources, territory, or partners. Finding teeth with damage indicates cruel contractions between individuals. Liviophan melvillii a giant predatory sperm whale, reaching about 55 feet in length. He possessed huge teeth up to 36 centimeters long and powerful jaws, capable of applying deep wounds. Libyophan ate large marine animals and was a real competitor to Megalodon. Basilosaurs and Ziggorizus Giant ancient Christmas whales, for example, Basilosaurus, also occupied the upper positions of the food chain, competing with Megalodon for large animals and whales. The ancestors of modern braids began to appear by the end of the existence of Megalodon. Groups of these whaling could successfully compete for production and even attack young or weakened Megalodons, reducing their number and accessibility of food. The flocks of ancient sharks, such as hemicycles and carharidones, could attack or select prey from young or wounded megalodons. Some ancient sea crocodiles, such as perpsis, could reach more than 30 feet in length and occupy similar ecological niches, competing with young megalodons for prey and territory. Titanoboa was the largest snake that had ever existed on Earth which lived about 58 million years ago, shortly after the extinction of dinosaurs. She reached impressive sizes, up to 50 feet in length and weighed more than tons. Despite this, even so huge the predator could have dangerous opponents and competitors. Probably the most serious threat was other Titanoboa, competing for the territory, food resources, and partners. Fights between such giants could lead to serious injuries or even death. Giant ancient crocodiles, reaching lengths up to 40 feet, could successfully compete with Titanoboa for food and territory. The clashes between these reptiles could be cruel and dangerous, especially in water or near the coastline. Carbone mice. A huge freshwater turtle, the diameter of the shell of which reached 7 feet. Carbonimus had very powerful jaws capable of applying serious injuries, and could successfully defend the Titanoboa attacks. Large ancient sharks that inhabited the oceans and entered the mouths of the rivers could pose a threat to Titanoboa, especially for young individuals, when they swam or hunted in shallow water. Some predatory mammals, such as ancient creodons, could be potential competitors, especially for young prey or carrion. Direct clashes were probably rare, but competition for resources existed. Huge ancient fish, such as arapim or other large predatory species, could compete with Titanoboa for food, especially in fish rivers and lakes. We watched this video. Put your finger up and leave the comments. Subscribe to our channel right now. And of course, Click on the bell so as not to miss new and interesting videos from the real channel Unreal.